18 is a uh, parallel flaw method of reasoning questions. So uh, read this argument, identify and abstract away the argument form and figure out what's wrong with it before we attempt the answers to uh, try to match it. So we have, uh, so far this summer, it's been no rain in the valley. Okay, but usually a few inch of rain fall each summer. So for summers in this valley, um, I'm just going to say a U for usually, right? It's kind of like most, I don't know, just U for usually. Um, usually what? It rains, right? At least a little bit. And so far, I mean, how many weeks are in a summer? I don't know, 12 weeks in a summer. So, right, so like uh, 11 weeks have passed. So only one week left, right? One uh, week left, one week remaining, okay? So we conclude that it will probably rain in the valley within the next week. So, I don't know, likely uh, rain in the last week, right? In the, in the uh, last week. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to amend this to say last week, right? So that's, that's it. That's our argument. Right for the summer, which captures all these weeks, right? Not just the last week. Summer usually rains. So far, it hasn't rained yet. Oh, I guess I guess forgot that. So far, it hasn't rained yet. We have one week left. Therefore, it's likely going to rain in this last week, right? I mean, you see that as a bad argument, right? I mean, when you say usually a few inches fall each summer, that sounds like it's an average. It doesn't. It doesn't mean that it must rain every. every also, it just that's not how weather works either, right? All right, so let's take a look at the answers. Uh, a says, Aisha has finished proofreading all but the last two pages of an issue. So this is good, right? The last two pages is uh, correspond analogized to the last week. Uh, all the previous pages correspond to all the previous weeks of the summer of the journal um, P and has encountered no errors, okay? Uh, so that's like, that's like all the weeks of summer up to this point, no rain. All the pages up to this point, no errors. However, there are sometimes a few errors in the issue. Yeah, that's not good. This doesn't match now. Right, this statement needed to say, uh, usually there are a few errors in every issue of P, just like how they, we say usually uh, it rains for every summer. Right, so there may be errors in the pages that's not checked. So maybe it's also wrong. Right, this should have said usually, and this should have said likely. Right, to match this probably. Right, this this should have matched. Uh, sometimes should have matched. Uh, usually over here. Right, so that's why A is not good. B says there are generally few errors in, in an issue of uh, the, the journal P. So this is good. Generally few errors, like usually, that matches, right? So um, I don't know, every issue of P generally slash usually has got a few errors. We got to say, you should finish proofreading all but the last two pages, has to encounter no errors. Good. So no errors so far. There are only, uh, last week, there are only two pages left, right? So what does, what does it need to say? B's got a chance of being right. What does it need to say? Anticipate it. Likely, in the last two pages, there are going to be errors, just like how li likely uh, in the last week there's going to be rain. Hence, there are probably no errors, no errors in the pages that she has not yet checked. No, that's the, that's the opposite way. B's gone. C says, on average, there are a few errors in an issue of uh, the journal P. So good. So in the journal P, you know, on average, there are some errors. So usually the case is there are errors. Right, on average, a few errors, like four or five, I don't know, however many errors. Uh, she's finished proofreading all but the last two pages, uh, found no errors. Good. So, so far, no errors, two pages left. So, all the setup looks just like this. What does it need to say? It needs to say that likely, right, likely uh, there will be errors in the last two pages, right? So, there are probably errors in the pages she has not yet checked. Perfect. Sees our right answer. D says Aisha has proofread several issues of the journal P has encountered no errors, but seldom any errors in the issue of the journal. What? Okay. Now we're talking about like a couple issues, no errors. There are probably no errors in the next. I don't. I don't know. This this is too far to analogize. Five says there are usually errors in each issue of P, so this is good uh, for P. Usually there are errors since she's finished reading the uh, latest issue. No errors, but she finished reading it already. This is like summer's ended already, and there's no rain, right? And then something about her being mistaken. What is that? 